Okay? Okay. Things are falling out. What's up my humans and welcome back to my channel and if you are new here, thank you for clicking on this video and welcome to Life with Sina. So we talk all things beauty, productivity, positivity and the occasional vlog here and there. So in today's video, I actually been waiting to film this for so long and I have had some real discipline because I actually received this package about two weeks ago. And I'm sure from the title you guys will see that I decided to try out Switch Beauty, which is a local South African beauty makeup brand. And I've seen all the hype about it. I actually even follow them on Instagram, but I never bothered to order any of their makeup. So I have ordered and this got delivered about two weeks ago, literally New Year's time it got delivered. If you guys want to see what I think of Switch Beauty and what I got, then just keep watching. So it came like this and just in the packet and it's got pink bubble wrap okay so first things first ooh, I'm a little skeptical on the way that it's packaged and delivered because I know with career companies and delivery service your package gets thrown around a lot from like being packaged at your wherever you ordered it to the career picking it up and then going to the sorting warehouses etc it gets thrown around and thrown into trucks and just pulled out and thrown back a lot so i hope nothing is broken in here because it okay, so you guys can see it's products are just wrapped in bubble wrap pink bubble wrap which is cute um i thought that it would come in like a box and then bubble wrapped or something because you know things can break and things are not handled with care with career companies even if you put fragile in the box let's be honest so the first thing i got from switch beauty is this i'm gonna come closer <laughs> um is this prime time kit lip exfoliating gel and matte balm um i bought this because i like the idea of a lip prepping because i do wear a lot of liquid lipsticks and it annoys the crap out of me because my lips are so dry pull it out and okay so we got our two little tubes there what is this this okay this is the priming balm and this is the prepping gel so next this is a uh, the oh this is the liquid luxe super black eyeliner pin okay the box is really cute i really like the pink though of the packaging Oh, I kind of thought it was going to be pink. Alright, so that's the liner. I'm excited to try the liner because I don't like marker liners. But I saw some pretty good reviews on how good this is. So, Then I also picked up the Beach Brow Life Proof. <laughs> Pigmented AF Brow Full and Set. That's actually cute. And I'm going to open it right here. I got shade number 3. Um, I hope this is the right shade because I'm used to putting brown on my brows all the time. So I guess today, I don't know, it looked online like the colors. It was difficult to match things up, I'm not going to lie. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, it's really cute. Smaller, but it's cute. Okay. Cute little spoolie. Oh, I need to clip this hair back because it's actually really hot. Uh, next up, we're going to look at, I got the two, the Bubble Blush Singles. There was the palette, but I looked at the palette and a lot of those colors, there's six colors in the palette, I think. And there's no way that I'm using all six colors. So I picked up two colors, which I think that I would have liked. I got Flush and Pink Dew. My nose is itchy. Um, so I got Flush and Pink Dew. And if we open it up, oh, it's also pink. It's also very tiny. But I did think it was going to be bigger. So small. They look like travel sizes, to be honest. Did I get like the wrong size? Is there a larger size or is this... Then next, I got the Air Gloss Weightless Lip Gloss. I don't wear lip gloss often, but it wasn't special, so I thought I would try it. 
the lip gloss and I got this in the color the shade that bitch then the one that I really really was excited for was their new actual cheekbones um, this is a bronzer that has a warm tone and a light warm tone and a cool tone so I had no idea what color to get so I got shade 2 I have a feeling shade 2 is gonna be the wrong color for me but um, I'm sure I can make it work somehow I really have a feeling this is the wrong color. I like the white. It's cute and... Okay. Maybe the color's a little bit wrong. This is what shade it comes with a little plastic thing which I like. Oh, and it comes with a mirror. I think that this might be a little bit dark for me. And then I got the Switch Beauty Superhero Spray. I've seen really good things about this. Um, this is the aloe vera soothing skin mist and dewy makeup set use hashtag superhero spray as both oh sorry there's no oh, there's a full stop there that i didn't read oh there is no full stop but there's supposed to be a full stop okay use hashtag superhero spray as both a skincare step and a makeup setting spray three things that i got was the air mat i wanted to get a lot more of these but the colors that i wanted were not in stock so I just picked up the three that were in stock. I really hope that they restock soon because I, I know I'm going to love these. This is the shade Destiny and then I've got Supreme and shade Gen C. So, okay, so it's not a... Oh man, did I just scrape it? Okay, so it turns out that this is not a twist lipstick. I thought it was a twist lipstick. Um, I'm, oh, there was a sharpener on the site. Was I supposed to buy the sharpener too? Try the superhero spray first before I put my makeup on because I want to actually try it as a skincare step first. So I'm going to spray it on my face to kind of prep my skin if that makes sense. Ooh. Ooh, okay. It's got a bit of a floral smell, but it's not like a strong smell. Um, the mist is really nice. Let's. I did not get it on my face. I think I sprayed too much. But like I honestly didn't even feel it hit my face. Where did it go? Okay, it's on my face. Um, so it feels like it's not hitting your face, but it is hitting your face. So don't go wild with this like I just did. It's a very, very fine mist. So it, it doesn't taste good. I'm just going to go off camera real quickly and just put a bit of a face on. Okay, and I'm back and I've got some concealer on Ooh, and it's hot. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and do the beach brow. I didn't fill my brows in because I actually want to see how this works. So I want to see how this beach brow works um, just alone on my eyebrows. We know my brow eyebrows have a very hard life. Okay, and let's let's do this. Whoa, okay. What? Um, okay, I'm quite shocked. This is actually filling in my brows, like you can see the difference. Okay, um, so you can clearly see the difference between this brow and that brow. I'm not even looking at the lens, I'm looking at the viewfinder. What? Let's do the other one and see if I can get this one to be as good looking as this one right now. And I scraped off a lot of product and it still filled my entire brow with only one dip. Okay, my brows look terrible because I actually haven't waxed or shaped them at all. But this is making me feel good. So, those are my brows. Um, they are <laughs> a little bit dark <laughs> because, like I said, I got shade 3 and shade 3 did end up being black. But I am really, really impressed with the fact that this just filled my entire brow in. Um, it's difficult to get it even because... 
yeah I've said it a million times already my brows do not grow even um, it made them thick it fold them in it it's holding it up really impressed with this so next I think I'm going to go ahead and do liner so I'm gonna try out the liquid luck liner um, I hope this goes well <laughs> So let's do this, shall we? Wow. Okay, I'm going to do the other eye off camera real quickly. Okay, so my line is on. I am shocked <laughs> at how well this pin worked. I didn't have to press hard. I didn't have to like try. It just glided on my eyes. I got my wings so nice and sharp. And it is like black. It's like pitch black. It went over the eyeshadow so smoothly. It didn't pick up any pigment from the eyeshadow and transfer onto the marker. This is better than a lot of the high-end brands like I had the Charlotte Tilbury um, liquid marker pen and this is better than that Charlotte Tilbury this is better than Charlotte Tilbury hashtag liquid luck like damn now I think I'm gonna move on to the fun part of making this actual cheekbones work for me so like I said it is a bit dark but let's add some shape to my face and see if we can get this going. So there's a cool tone and a warm tone. I don't know which is which right now. Okay, so you can see this is the cool tone and this is the warm tone. I like the warm tone. It looks like it's going to work for me. I'm going to dip into the warm tone. That picks up a lot of pigment already on the brush. And let's see. Okay. Blend, blend, blend. Ooh, blend, blend, blend. Okay. This is quite nice, actually. I'm going to put some on the other side and then see how I can even my face out. First impression of this, I did not use a lot on the brush for it to transfer onto my skin. I'm gonna go in with a bigger fluffy brush now to kind of blend. Do I know what I'm doing? No. So I'm just gonna not do my nose anymore. So that's a bronzer. Um, it pays off a lot. A lot. This color actually isn't so bad for my skin tone, I think. I think on camera it shows a lot more than in person. Um, I kind of like it actually. I move on to these tiny little uh, bubble blush. I'm going to put flush on... What's this? This is my right side. So let's see. Whoa! Would it be too much if I add a little bit more? Now this is Pink Dew. It honestly looks... The freaking same. I think that it looks like there's nothing on my face um, if you look at it on camera, but if you look in the mirror, it adds a nice like wash of color so I don't look, you know, pale. It blended really really quickly into the skin it didn't end up looking so patchy on my skin um, which I'm quite surprised with because I thought it was gonna move my concealer it actually didn't move my concealer at all it just sat nicely on top of it so now we're gonna look at the very very last part of this uh, and that is my lips it's a lip prepping gel and a lip priming balm the lip prepping gel says Lip prepping gel removes dead skin and dry flaky bits on your lips, which is me every day. Apply the gel and to the lip area and wait 60 to 90 seconds. I thought I was going to say 60 minutes. Shoot. Then use circular motions with your fingertip to rub the gel in until you see the dead. Okay, so it's kind of like the body shop peel, face peel. Okay. Rub 
Rubbing silk in the motions. Then the next step is to apply the balm after the lip prepping gel and before going in with your choice of lipstick. So, did I put too much? Damn it, I put too much again. That feels really nice actually. Let's see how it applies with the lipstick. So, the three colors that I did say I got is Destiny, Gen Z, and Supreme, and I am gonna go in with Gen Z. And I guess I'll do swatches of the others another time, probably. That apply really really nicely really really smooth let me zoom you out <laughs> it took a while to build up the color I'm not going to lie it didn't like give a first burst of color I had to go over a few times but I don't know if that maybe has to do with the priming balm moving on I'm going to try the air gloss okay there we go now you can see that a bit better See what they mean when it's not a sticky formula which is actually really nice because i hate feeling like i have like glue on my lips so you guys that is all of the switch products that i got and i have tried everything at this point the beach brow um so freaking impressed with this it filled in my brows completely i'm just like it's been about an hour and a half now and my brows are still standing up like I wanted them to because usually by now they would have flopped down. So I'm very, very, very impressed with this little guy. Also, so flippin' impressed with this and it just, it hasn't even flaked off yet to be honest. And it went on so smoothly. Yeah, I like this one too. The, what is this? Hashtag actual cheekbones. This also I'm very impressed with because it actually stayed the bubble blush. So I did say earlier that I'm surprised that these things are so tiny for the price. But there's a lot of product in this and I don't think you're supposed to use a lot. But I didn't use a lot and it's practically non-existent on my face already. So I don't really have an opinion on these. I think... I think I will have to play around with these more and try them out a bit more. I do like the fact that they blend into your skin really, really easily and they don't move your concealer, your foundation, etc. away. So these I'm not so sure about, but I will play with them a bit more. The Prime Time Kit, I really, really like these, especially if I'm planning for my lipstick to last super long because I did this before the air mat and then i still stopped the video and then went out for like an hour came back and now i'm continuing the video and my lipstick stuck real well so air mats i bought obviously the three colors um which i've probably said so many times in this video already so it was destiny supreme and gen z these are the bomb so the first two colors gen z and supreme are really really nice it takes a bit of work to get it onto your lips but once it's there it stays the air gloss i like the air gloss it's not sticky it just feels like a normal lip gloss that's just not sticky the color is really pretty for just like a natural look or i think this will look oh this would look so bomb over the red lipstick to be honest and then there was the superhero spray which i really really like it's very misty like the spray is very misty it doesn't just shoot it into your face it mists it over your face it smells nice but it's not an overpowering smell it did not burn my skin which is really good and yeah i guess i will put this in an update video soon so for a local south african beauty brand i'm really impressed with this i did not expect like the eyebrows to be like this but um i'm sorry i'm very impressed by the eyebrow products but switch beauty well done I'm impressed. I'm very happy that I found you. Okay, I always had you, but I never really bought from you. But other than that, that is all I have for you guys today. If you guys enjoyed this video, let me know and thumbs up this video. And 
if there are any of these products that you have already and you've tried any other switch products and you want to recommend anything let me know down below with that i'm gonna leave this video here because honestly i've been trying to film this for like the past four hours now and it's been long so i'm gonna wrap this up i hope you guys have an amazing weekend and an awesome week ahead and i'll see you in my next video adios amigos